Oh, hey, I didn't see you guys there. Oldest, oldest trick in the YouTube handbook, right? No, but, um, yeah, uh, I didn't even touch it up. I mean, it's like, what, like, maybe like a one minute application? I'm a, little, I'm a little paranoid about overdrawing them, like, too much, you know what I mean? So I always do a little bit of that, like, a little bit of corrective, uh, basic bitch, amateur corrective procedures with your fingernails. Yeah, I do that sometimes. But, um, <clears throat> I'm, I'm in love with it, absolutely in love with it. So, um, we're going to move on to bronzer. <laughs> okay. I'm using my um, Benefit Cosmetics um, Mini Cheek Leaders uh, Bronzing Contour and um, Highlight Palette. I'm using the shade Gold Rush. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. I'm sure a lot of people are, are baffled by like how quickly I do my bronzer, but it's it's not like bronzer's not really. It's like the it's it's the process process in your makeup routine or slash, slash regimen that like honestly like doesn't really require um, that much like um uh, what's the word um. Like, you, you don't have to be that precise, if that makes sense. Okay. It's like, obviously, I'm not just gonna be, I'm not gonna be sloppy about it or anything, but, like, everybody knows where bronzer goes, you know what I mean? It's like... Because, I mean, I'm a, I'm a very pasty bitch, and I use, I use a shade, a foundation called Natural Ivory. Oh my god, look at that green with, the green lip with my blue eyes. Maybe it is more of a hunter green uh, now that it's dried a little bit. But what's so what's so crazy about it? Back to you, Jackie. Is it? It's drying like a liquid matte lipstick. What's up with that? I mean, I'm here for it all day long. Don't get me wrong. Okay. I think I'm just gonna make this look, this really about like about the lips this time. Like, I'm not gonna do eyeshadow or anything crazy like that. Um, so let's just go ahead and uh, use my brand new e.l.f. Neutralizing Concealer Palette. We're going to dive in with, oh my god, I love a brand new clean brush more than anything. Okay, we're going to dive into the green shade that I'm familiar with, and um, a little bit of this orange next to it, just a tiny bit. Okay, it's so creamy, look at that. It's so creamy and brand new. Oh, I'm, I'm, li I'm living for it. E.l.f. knows their shit. I'm already ruining the pan completely. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, let's see how this does. Probably got, got a little bit more than I needed, but that's okay. I can always buff it out if it's too much. Okie doke. Ooh, yeah, that's gonna be pretty. I can already tell T-Zone. Ooh, this brush is brand new and it feels that way. In the best possible way. Have a few little breakouts down here, so that's what that's about. Most people are like, most people would probably, would probably be like, that's an odd place to do your concealer, Steve's, and I'd be like, bitch, you're right. It, it, ain't the, it ain't the most normal place, that's for sure. Okay, let's buff out that concealer. Ooh. Hello, effortless blending. Oh, buffing it out in like two seconds flat. Okay. Let's get those under eye bags snatched. My, my, my matte foundation does a pretty good job of um, concealing the under eye bags. Honestly, it does. But the concealer does a wonder. And like, if you guys aren't familiar with Benefit Cosmetics, they're um, they're uh, just every product of theirs, the fra except for the mascara. Their fra the fragrance is just like chocolate. It's, it smells like chocolate. It's so good. Chocolate and cinnamon. I think that's, that's what that's what like it makes me think of. Problem area. Let's get rid of those. I got problem areas. Let's get rid of those problem areas. I need to neutralize problem areas. Let's leave them. Goodbye. <laughs> that was the first time I actually wrote a somewhat decent song. I'm just kidding. I really don't think it was decent, but hey, it rhymed. It had a little bit of a, little bit of a uh, melody to it, so. Say what you want about me, girls and boys. Okay. Um, yeah, I cannot forget to um, to link in the description box. Um, me, uh, 
I mean, like, uh, how, where to download and stream Gods and Monsters, because I'm not getting copywritten, not do, not while my channel is thriving, girls and boys. Okay, let's get a little bit onto the upper eye, where I have a little bit of discoloration and pinkness. Just trying not to mess, mess up my mascara too much. Okay. I mean, that's a, that, that is a fantastic, I mean, for four ninety five, can you beat that, honestly? Look, even with the big light on, it's like, come on. Fantastic. I'm glad I didn't, like, choose a brand that I wasn't familiar with, you know what I mean? That I haven't already used and, like, wasn't already one of my tried and trues, if that makes sense. Okay. Okay, she's got green lips. She's concealed. Um, we're going to, for blush, we're just going to use um, my uh, Kaleido Cosmetics because I think it's going to go really, really pretty with, I got this in my Ipsy bag, with my, um, with the lip product. Look at that. It's like a burnt, um, sienna type reddish, like, just, it's a beautiful blush is what I'm trying to say. But here, big light off time. Let's get my blush brush. Look, it even says blush on the handle, you guys. I'm not lying. It's for your blush. It's absolutely for your blush, so, yeah, blush. Okie doke. I just get about this much. I've been doing a lot more, uh, a lot less, uh, cakey on the blush, if that makes sense. So yeah, <sighs> okay. Let's do this. Thank you, Collider Cosmetics. You've been very good to me as of late. Okay. And Tothi showed me, like, you put it where, like, if you smile, it doesn't droop down to here. You know what I mean? So yeah. It's, I've been doing it a lot higher, thanks to my girl, at Tati Westbrook. Ooh, God, look at that with the lip. It looks so pretty. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Happy early birthday present to me, and thank you once again, Mom, um, for giving me some early birthday money to go a little bit shop, to go, gro go, to go grocery shopping and to get, like, a few things from my channel. I appreciate it, and I love you so much. Okay. <laughs> I'm having so much fun, and I'm... Uh, like, I think that's, um, what, I think that's why I've, uh, my past few videos, like, the ones, all the ones I, like, I did six, I made six videos yesterday, which is, like, so out of my comfort zone, but every single time I made one, like, I, I did four, I did four or five different looks, and, like, every single time I made a, a look or whatever, I just, um, I mean, a video, uh, I just felt more inspired th than the next, and, um, I think that's what YouTube's about, and I really think that translates and resonates through the camera, but what do you guys think? I'm, I'm genuinely curious about that one. If, if you don't comment about anything else in the video, I'd really appreciate it. appreciate your advice and, like, your feedback on this part, on this aspect of it. Okay. I'm a little crazy, so I blush those ears a little bit. Because, <laughs> you know, I mean, I'm, I'm super paranoid about, about like, uh, blending it into my hairline already. But I really think that's gorgeous. Let me get my Big Daddy Eco Tools brush, as I so lovingly call it, because this side's a little bit more blushing. So, yeah, let's even those out just a little bit. Perfect. Yes. Perfect, yes. I love a perfect blush application, which doesn't always happen for me, but hey, I roll with the punches. Okay, um, we're, and then, uh, like I said, we're going to end this video with a highlighter. Um, I will probably post, um, a wear test video, um, after this one, because this one is, is going to be super long, based on the fact that I'm already almost in the 10 minute marker, and I made a 30 minute video, and a, a 4 minute video, that's what walked me around, and I, I, know, I know you guys don't mind watching long videos, and they're actually good for my channel and everything, but, um, yeah, we're just going to do a little bit of IBY Radiant 24K Radiant Glow Highlighter. It's a beautiful gold. You guys have seen that a multitude and a plethora of times on my channel, which is also definitely um, an idea for future merch of mine. I would love to I would love to see little phrases in mine, the catchphrases in mine, because it's like, let's face it, at this point, I mean, I have like seven, eight different catchphrases. I mean, I have a lot of catchphrases. Once again, this is not a toot your own horn or brag about yourself stage channel. It's a makeup review ASMR mukbang um, makeup tutorial channel. <laughs> okay. Let's finish it off with that highlight, and you know I'm not, you know your girl sees is not gonna turn off that big light, um, because, I mean turn on the big light, because uh, I want to, I always like to end my videos, um, with a blinding, blinding highlighting moment, so let's see how it goes. Get as close as possible so you guys can clock me on my pores that are non-existent, because I've been, I've been using my, um, REP Real Elemental, oh, my lighting almost just fell off, there we go, perfect. My, um, REP Real Elemental Practice, um, uh, facial mask, and it's been doing wonders. I've, been, I've used it for, like, 13 days now. Oh, yeah. Gold and green, are you kidding? Gold and, like, greenish blue, hunter green. I'm, I'm here for it all day long, okay. 
just trace that nose ever so gently. Give it a little bit of a contour effect without having to contour. I'm here for it all day. Yes. Okay. And then just right above that blush line. And then whenever I'm done, I will um, buff my blush, bronzer, and highlight line, highlighting line all into one. Maybe trace above. Yeah, trace my brow line just a little bit. Since I, since I didn't do shadow, I think it'll give um, my eyes a lot more dimension, seeing as I, I skipped that step. But I really did, I really just skipped it, not because the video is running long. I really don't mind about having long content at all. I actually prefer it, just because I think that you guys get to see, like, um, the real me more. Just, like, because I open up a lot more and let my guard down. I mean, I always let my guard down, but, like, the more I'm on camera, the more I just forget I'm on camera, if that makes sense. Okay. Let's twirly twirly on the tip of that nose. So from everywhere I go, you're going to see it glow. I'm just kind of coming up with like some sick ass bars like off the cuff, right? It's crazy. All right, let's buff out that highlight a little bit, like I always do. I always do a little bit of a trace like this because since I use a gold highlighter, it really kind of does give me that contour effect from a certain angle. If you catch my drift, but yeah, um, I'm so glad. I'm so thankful that I finally found my niche on YouTube. It's the most humbling, cathartic, transcendent, transformative, and fantastic thing that's ever happened. It's astronomically monumental, is what I'm trying to say. Um, also, shout out to you, Michael Walker. Um, thank you for commenting on my video and being back in my life because you're one of my, you're probably my favorite, my favorite person from that old Hangouts group. I'm not going to mention the name because I've, I've just moved past it and I found my niche. And thank you for being along for my journey and for commenting on the fact that like you um, also agreed that I found my own niche. It means the world to me. I really appreciate it. Okay, let's buff out everything. Let's blend that cons uh, the contour line, I mean the contour, the bronzer, highlight, and blush line all into one because that's the method to my madness. That's how I do it, okay? Oh, look at that swatch arm. It's so vibrant. Like, it just, it's already dried completely. You know what I mean? That's awesome. And so has my lip product, okay? I think we're good to go, boys and girls. What do you think? I think this is an everyday look. I think all the products that I used are affordable, and if you can't, if you, it, I mean, I don't, I'm not really sure because these all came in my Ipsy bag or whatever, like these four, um, because they're they're relatively high end. Um, but uh, I, I mean, you can always like find dupes and replicate this look if you want to. It's an everyday look. I mean, it's a green lip, but I think whenever you make everything else minimal and don't use a crazy green highlight or something too, because I think obviously that would be a little bit a little bit counterproductive and contradictive to your look. But um, I hope you guys like this look. And, um, once again, thank you so much for, um, thank you so much for clicking on today's video, and thank you for watching today's video. And in closing in today's video, I just want to say that, um, I'm right where I'm supposed to be at the exact time that I'm supposed to be there. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me, that was the first time I've called the whole time filming. But, um, yeah, no, uh, I just thank you for allowing me to realize, um, that I'm at the right place at the right time, that I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing at the time I'm, at, the, at the time that I'm supposed to be doing it, and for embracing me and embracing my dream, because it's the best thing that's ever happened to me, and I don't I don't say that lightly, and I love each and every one of you, subscriber, non-subscriber, or just someone that happened to stumble upon this video, and um, since I've officially begun to start to ramble and rant, I'll break out my busted ass fan, and since I'm out of setting spray, I'll get a little bit of that um, excess highlighter and everything else off my face. And I'll give you guys a little bit of a breeze, some breeze action too, with a busted ass bitch using a busted ass fan. But um, okay, you guys. Um, until next time, stay beautiful because Steez thinks that everyone is. Hey, you guys. What's up? It's Steez. Uh, first and foremost, I would like to apologize formally from little old gay moi that um, I didn't get, I didn't have enough storage space. It's in the description box of the video that is 80% uh, processed as we speak that you guys haven't seen yet. But um. You guys will see um, the second half of that video before you see this part of the video because I'm going to edit the two of them together. I'm sure you guys don't care about the analytical and editing aspects of the whole thing, but I just I promised you guys a wear test. It has been five hours um, since I applied the lipstick um, and my full face. So I'll let you guys get a good look. And all I, I haven't eaten, eaten anything. Um, I, I just warmed up some bell peppers, like some uh, Marie Callender's like, uh, stuffed bell peppers that I'm going to eat like right after shooting this. But... Um, if it wasn't for, like, the middle part, this lipstick has, it, it is definitely approved for me. Um, I think the wear test hold, held up really, really well. Um, also, I think that, like, the blush that I'm using, the concealer, um, and also the foundation is fantastic based on the, fast, the fact that, like, I have combination to oily skin, and 
nowhere can you see like a huge pore. My blackheads and like whiteheads and stuff are completely concealed. Um, my under eye bags are completely, have completely disappeared. Um, my mascara is holding up beautifully, um, as well as my bronzer. And highlight as well. Definitely the highlight. I mean, that cube is both popping. And like I said, uh, I've had a few beverages. Um, I think I, I had, I mean, I, I, I think. I know for a fact that I had um, a couple um, Starbucks uh, drinks uh, from the gas station next door. Um, yeah, by the way, I'm sporting a little ponytail because I'm getting, my hair is getting so long. <laughs> But, um, once again, I just want to, like, formally, like, shout out, um, my dear friend Ash, slash Gabby, and my, slash, and she's also a subscriber, and that's how we became friends. Um, uh, we stumbled upon each other on, um, Rich Lux's, uh, comment section, I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong, Ash. Um, and also, uh, Jackie, I love you so much, and I don't, I hope I'm, I hope I'm not being a creeper by shouting you guys out so much, but I just love you more than words could possibly ever adequately convey, slash express. But, um, you can clock me on it in the comments down below if you, um, feel the need to do so. But, um, I think that, um, it's a beautiful shade. I think, um, this long after applying it, and it's still being metallic, and it's still holding up, and the only part that's messed up is where, like, I would take a sip of my, uh, sweet tea and my Starbucks drinks, like I said. But, um, I don't want to make this video crazy, crazy, crazy long. And, it, it, like I said before, it's about the quality of, it's about the quality and not... The quantity when it comes to content and on YouTube and also on my little humble side girl Topanga channel as well. But um, I love you guys so much for watching and until next time, whom and what does Cheeseburger love more than anything in the whole wide world? Well, he doesn't have um, a fandom slash standum name yet because it's up to his uh, viewers, commenters, and subscribers to come up with that and I'm definitely not going to come up with my own quote unquote fandom name since I'm becoming somewhat of a public figure and blah blah blah. Shut up Steez, I know, I'm sure it just like got a few dislike. Oh, I just felt the dislike. Oh there, there's one now. Huh. Oh oh I it was too late. I tried to grab it and snatch it back and make it a like, but it was too late. <laughs> but now I've officially began to runt to runt. <laughs> I've officially I've officially began to ramble and rant. But um, until next time, you guys, stay beautiful, because Steesburger thinks that everyone is. And yes, you're not mistaken, it's B-U-R-G-E-R -E now, just like the cheeseburger and hamburger. What do you think of that?